welcome today we are going to do the distance vector routing using rip protocol or ap protocol using cisco packet trainer so first go to file new and then go to this network devices and choose any one thing we are choosing 1841 router <coughs> place router 0 router 1 and router 2 go to this end devices here select a pc place two pcs now we are going to do the connections so before that if you place the pointer over here we get to what are the ports available click on that select wtc 2t which off this one it is a switch off it the green light goes off drag and place this dual serial port wan interface given given here and then switch it on again the green light has to glow close it same for router 1 w ic 2t switch it off drag and place the port on it again close same for router 2 w ic 2t off place and on and close it now we're going to make the connections click on this connections fast ethernet connection is done between the pc port and the routers and then go for this serial dte port click on the router 0 serial 0/0/0 slash slash to here 0/0/0 slash slash serial port 0 to 0 same way again serial dte from here serial port 1 to serial port 0 again connection from router 2 serial port 1 to serial port 1 here now the connections are made next we should give the ip address to the computers click on the computer go for desktop ip configuration get the ip address 10.0.0.2 and subnet mask if you click it comes automatically close it Then we go for the next PC desktop IP configuration. Uh, in that, give the address twenty point zero point zero point two, and then subnet mask comes and close it. Now, next we need to enable the connections. So, uh, click on the router zero now. Go for the CLA. So the programming steps are given in the uh, description. Uh, you need to type it in order so before that so uh, would you like to enter the initial configuration dialog no and enter next again and enter and then enable type enter configure terminal Uh, it was a wrong command so again i'm typing cnf enter invalid input detected enter configuration commands one per line configure terminal in router hash it has to come start closing it open this again give interface fast ethernet space 0 slash 0 and enter then ip address 
10.0.0.1 space 255.0.0.0 enter no shutdown enter and then exit so now if you see uh, we have the green color connection there uh, what all we have typed is enable after the no enable configure terminal interface fast ethernet 0 slash 0 uh, ip address 10.0.0.1 255.0.0.0 no shutdown and exist exit no now connection is established between the pc and the router 0 so next we need to do the router to router connection so next we'll do the connection establishment for the third router uh, for the next router so i'll close this i'll open the router one and again cli again no enter enable the router one then configure terminal enter interface the serial code so serial 0 slash 0 slash 0 ip address 192.168.1.250 space 255.0.0.0 255.252 no shutdown and exit now uh, that connection has become green which means the connection is done so now again uh, connection configures no configure interface serial zero slash zero slash zero And then IP address 192.168.1.246 space Interface serial zero slash zero slash one. So this is the correct one. After that, IP address one ninety two point one sixty eight point one point two forty six space. 255.255.255.252 then give clock rate space 64,000 and then bandwidth as 64 and then no shutdown and exit 
So now we need to write the code for the last router. Close this. Open the last router. Go for CLI to write the code. And then give no enter. Enable. Configure terminal. Enter. Interface. Fast Ethernet. Space zero slash zero enter and then IP address space twenty point zero point zero point one space two fifty five point zero point zero point zero and enter then again no shutdown and exit. Next, interface serial zero slash zero slash zero and enter IP address one ninety two point one sixty eight point one point two forty five space two fifty five point two fifty five point two fifty five point 252 no shutdown and exit so now we have uh, written the code for the router and select the router 2 and then uh, i need to interface again to the serial next serial port interface serial 0 slash 0 slash 1. So next we are writing the code for the next serial code. IP address 192.168.1.253 space 255.255.255.252 and then no shutdown and then exit. So now if you move this and see, we can see uh, all green connections are there. So the connections are established uh, successfully. Now uh, root is used. So click on the Router 0 now uh, in CLI should give the RIP address. So for that give enable and then configure terminal router RIP network 10.0.0.0 .0 .0 .0 network 192.168.1.252 uh, network 192.168.1.248 and enter exit now close this we need to enable the second router, so go for the router 1. And then in CLI, give enable configure terminal. And then router. RIP, you can write the command for RIP, RIP, so network space 192.168.1.244, network space 192.168.1.248, and then 
close this open the last router so here again router which was used spell mistake router rip. so inside rip. network 200.0.0.0 and then network 192.168.1.252 it's again network 192.168.1.252 44 and exit so now uh, close this go for the simulation so green places connections are there uh, so go for edit filters uncheck everything except the trip protocol and close this now go for running it so we can see uh, where the connections are there in those places the uh, packets are being transferred the packet from here is being transferred to the places where uh, network connection is there so we had made a mistake in this place so that's why there is no green color here but everywhere there should be green color and the data has to travel from router to router to know it does not travel 